Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Peace be unto you. Welcome to Hanging with Hamza. No. <laughs> I was that the intro music. We don't have any intro music? Okay. Okay, I guess we don't have any intro music. Well, let's get started then. My name is Hamza Abdullah, and I'll be your host for this evening. Well, I hope every evening because it's called Hanging with Hamza. I love good people, and I want to bring them together every week. Uh, inshallah, God willing, every Wednesday, we'll have a guest on and we'll chop it up. So, I pray that we can all benefit from this and... Without further ado, let's welcome in our guest. Like I was saying, we want to bring you a very special... Hmm? No, I was looking at camera two. There is no camera two, okay. Apparently there is no camera two, there's no intro music. Uh, next thing you know, they'll be saying there's no check. And you know we don't get down like that. Uh, like I was saying tonight, we have a very special guest, uh, and I believe he's someone who will be able to engage the audience, someone who you are familiar with, viewers at home. So please, without further ado, I would like to bring in our guest. Hey, Asalaamu As Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Salaam wa Rahmatullahi wa Barakatuh. Keep okay, it. Whoa, 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 cowboy. Give me all that extra. Slow down. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. The Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu uh, said that when you are given a greeting, then you reply with a similar greeting or one better than that. So I chose better. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you. One upper. Boy, trying to take, take over my show. Well, brother, Dr. Sheikh Mufti, can you at least explain what you said? Uh, the only thing from there that I am is a brother. And uh, yes, I can. Uh, you said, Assalamu Alaikum, which means peace be unto you. And I responded, Wa Alaikum Salam, which means and peace be unto you as well. Um, and I added, Wa Rahmatullahi Wa Barakatuh, which means and the grace, mercy, and blessings of God may they be upon you as well. So, oh, okay. I thought you were trying to show me up. Oh, no, 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 never, never. <laughs> Well, thank you. See, I knew we got the right guy. Well, let's introduce our viewers to our guests for this evening. Try to get me again. No camera too. Tonight on Hanging with Hamza, we have brother Hamza Abdullah. Hamza Abdullah, am I saying that right? Yeah, yeah, you're good. Okay, good. <laughs> Uh, okay, Hamza Abdullah is a retired NFL veteran of seven years. Uh, he last played with the Arizona Cardinals in 2011. Um, him and his younger brother, Hussein Abdullah, uh, left the NFL in 2012 uh, to go to the Hajj Pilgrimage. Um, yeah, the Hajj Pilgrimage. Uh, his younger brother returned to play for the Kansas City Chiefs, and Hamza did not uh, return to play. Uh, he retired and began to pursue his passion and working toward the collective goal of wanting for his brother what he wants for himself. Very commendable. Uh, with that, let us welcome into the show, Brother Hamza Abdullah. Assalamu alaikum. Ooh, ooh okay. Man, y'all trying to get me back to 2003. Sorry about that, Brother Hamza. I got carried away. <laughs> no, no apologies needed. That clap was on beat. Okay, but yeah, as I was saying, uh, thank you and welcome to the show, Brother Hamza Abdullah. Alhamdulillah, it's good to be here. Thank you. Uh, it's an honor to be your first guest. Uh, may Allah reward you. Amin. Alhamdulillah. May Allah bless you and your family in this show. May I ask you something? Yeah, go right ahead. Why am I wearing this and you're wearing that? 
Because I'm not trying to impress nobody. I already got my own show. Fair enough. Proceed. Already. Brother Hamza, tell us about your transition and what you've been up to since leaving the NFL. Yeah, um, when I left the NFL, um, I found the transition to be a lot tougher than I had heard about. Um, and it was a lot tougher uh, on me and for other guys. And I just thought that uh, it could have been made a lot easier. Hmm. Uh, it can be streamlined. Uh, so um, I wanted to write some things down so that, inshallah, God willing, when Hussein came through, when he retired, he didn't have to face those same troubles. Um, I felt like it could have been made a lot easier. That's brilliant. Why didn't I think of that? So, Brother Hamza, you wrote this stuff down, and then what? Um, well, I wrote, I started writing uh, this stuff for Hussein, and then it ended up uh, becoming a memoir. Hamza Abdullah, come follow me. Hmm, I like that. Hamza Abdullah, come follow me? Yes, come follow me. Where did that come from? Like, where, where did the title come from? What do, and what does it mean? Yeah, well, um, my initial manuscript, I uh, had uh, the people around me read it. And one of the uh, brothers, one of the companions said, you should name this Come Walk With Me. Um, but that triggered something in my head that I had before um, when I was in college. Uh, I used to say, come follow me to my wife. And so I would uh, usher it, come out with a song called Come Follow Me. And it went like this. When you look at my life, all you see is videos and shows. But there's more to my life than people could ever know. Sometimes I gotta smile when I don't feel like smiling. Sit back and ride when I feel like driving. Nobody understands but you, girl. I can only see myself with you, girl. So and the song continued and then the hook said, come follow me, come follow me, come follow me. Well, check you out. Who are you? Oh, Jamie Foxx? Trying to get a record deal? No. Jamie Foxx used to sing on every show. Nobody peeped that. He was just trying to get a record deal. Okay. But anyway, yeah, that sounds cool. So to sum up your book in one sentence, what would you say um, to someone who says they're not a reader or they don't read memoirs or they don't read sports books? Um, sum it up for us. Uh, what would you say? I would say that you're right where you're supposed to be, uh, right in the middle of your transition or right in your transition. Um, and I wrote my book uh, in hopes that uh, you can learn from my story and put together some practical steps that we can do and work on every single day. And God will and our stories will mesh and we can learn and grow from, with each other. Okay. I like that. Mm -hmm. Kind of generic, but okay. You said keep it short. Okay, I appreciate that. Where can our viewers go to get your book? And what does it look like? Well, uh, they can go on Amazon. Uh, look up Hamza Abdullah, come follow me. Um, looking for your book? Yeah. Thank you. Um, Hamza Abdullah, come follow me. Um, look it up on Amazon. Uh, it's not a problem solver. Uh, it's just more of my story, um, and I wrote down a few steps, and I prayed that we can come together. You can read it. Uh, give it to someone who's going through a major transition in life, or maybe if you're going through a major transition in life, God willing, this will help. Awesome. Well, thank you very much for your time, Brother Hamza Abdullah. Uh, it was a pleasure to have you on the show. You're welcome back anytime. Um, Thank you very much to our viewers for tuning in. Uh, we hope that you enjoyed this show, and we hope that you will join us next week and the weeks thereafter. Go ahead and subscribe uh, to the channel so that God willing will bring you more, more content. Uh, like the page, share with your friends, and let us know in the comments who you would like to see next on Hanging with Hamza. Until next time, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.